Great to have you with us, everybody. Thanks for tuning in to Inside Michigan Football, presented by Meyer. This week's Elro Steel Man of the Week is Art Volo Jr. Since gaining Michigan Stadium press box access 40 years ago to document game days, Art has become an unofficial archivist of Michigan football. When the first game happens, the first game of the season, and I'm up there in what has to be the best seat in that stadium. And I'm saying, my God, as they run under the thing and the band comes out on the field, I get so choked up. It's emotional. I get all verklempt. I really do. You know, it's, uh, it's cool. His Oakland County home contains a treasure trove of behind-the-scenes Michigan moments. His audio and video collections take up nearly every square inch of his workspace. Sometimes I look at the shelves and say, my God, <laughs> how did I ever get this much stuff? If I lived to be 100, I wouldn't have enough time to get all this stuff transferred. Art is a radio guy and appreciates the home team call on Saturdays. The radio announcers are so much better than the TV guys because the TV guys always sound like they're for the other team. People look at this room and say, oh my gosh, you're so organized. Well, that's a falsehood. <laughs> it's not true. This would have been Art's 41st season in the press box. The COVID pandemic will keep him out, but there's always next year. And as long as I've got enough gas in the tank to keep going, they're going to have to drag me out screaming and kicking my legs because I ain't going anywhere until, uh, until the final touchdown. Art has been incredibly helpful to us, especially in the last few weeks. We'd also like to thank Mr. Greg Kinney from the Bentley Historical Library. The efforts of both those men are greatly appreciated. I'm Ed Kingerski. We'll see you soon.